evening or good morning or good afternoon wherever you are hi um, so I realized I didn't actually introduce myself not really I straight up just put my vlogs up I did a little chat gave you my plans but I didn't actually tell you who I am so I'm really sorry about that guys I just threw things up there so what I did um, to introduce myself and got you involved, I put it out there on Twitter, Facebook and Instagram and I got you to ask me questions, so I'm going to answer them now. I'm going to do a little Q&A and um, yeah, straight off the cuff, let's go for it. And we're back. Hi guys. So I just had to go find my phone because I can't really do a Q&A without the cues. Go figure. <laughs> um, okay, so let's get started. What's your favourite cheat meal? Alright, oh, well that's pretty easy actually. Um, my favourite cheat meal would be a burger. And the burger... Yeah, I always have a burger straight after comp. And I would love to always go for a, a very meaty, cheesy one. It's just fully loaded, guys. And it needs to be from a smokehouse. Because the flavours are so much more pungent, I think. And the quality of the meat is so much better. Um, and it'll be a side, side of super tater fries. Loaded again. It's going to have pulled pork, cheese and barbecue sauce on it. And dessert would be a cheesecake. So there you go. That's my favourite cheese, uh, cheese meal. <laughs> a cheap meal. Um, but yeah, the cheesecake would be like a salted caramel or... An Oreo one. Yeah, that works. Cool. Um, are there any benefits with less overhead? Um, Alright, okay then. That's quite good. The most important factors you need to remember with less or hit is the total calorie expenditure. Because um, you need to make sure that you've got your heart rate going, that you're sweating. Because otherwise, you're just not worked. Uh, I, know, I know it's kind of mean to say, but you're not. Um, if you enjoy a walk and as long as you've got your steps in, okay, that's fine. But if you want to burn more calories, you need to get your heart rate up. End of the day, that's what you need to do. Um, you can you can do less, that's absolutely fine. But the best one I would say is HIT. That's my opinion. Um, straight up, that's what I enjoy doing because I really feel like I've worked. And if you're short on time, it's really good because you've got that quick burst. So yeah, that's good. Uni <laughs> United or City. Okay, so this person knows I live in Manchester. Um, very sorry. I'm, I'm not either. I know, I'm probably in the, like, the worst city uh, to not be a football follower, but I, I'm not. Um, I, I can't even narrow it down because I, I don't know anything about the teams or the... I, I just don't know. Sorry. I, I don't follow it at all. Yeah. <laughs> I think I know who this is from. Would you live without hair extensions? <laughs> um, <laughs> I think I know who this is from. Would you live without hair extensions? <laughs> Hi Jenny. Um, no. Um, I mentioned that in the last video actually. Um, I used to wear clip-ins. And it was so bad for my hair because it used to pull and I used to pull my own hair out. It was so bad. Um, and since I got permanent hair extensions in, oh, it's just so much better. And I feel so much nicer. It just sounds weird, but I used to have long hair. I just, yeah, um, I can't live without. I just, you know, you can also you just feel like you just when you're done up, you feel good. When your hair's good, your skin's clear. You just feel good, like you don't even need to wear makeup. Um, so yeah, I would I would not live without hair extensions actually. Um, I love them. I really do. What's the ooh? What's best foods to cut belly fat? This is quite a popular question actually, because everyone's looking for that shortcut. There are no shortcut foods. What you need to make sure is you're in a calorie deficit. Okay, the first protocol is to be, the calorie deficit, it needs to be 500 calories below your maintenance. 
okay if you want to be in a surplus it's 500 above your maintenance and then you can work it out basically from your calorie calculator or your macro calculator is also on the internet um, so you can figure that one out um, granted there are foods to help with raw retention um, but you know, there are no foods to cut belly fat so I'm sorry guys if you want to cut the tire you need to put the work in there are no shortcuts burger or pizza um, well, burger for sure. I do like pizza though. You can put anything on a pizza, so it's pretty creative. I like that. Actually, the best pizza, just thinking about that because I'm going to be visiting my family soon. Um, yeah, my uncle makes a killer pizza. Um, I love homemade pizzas, so they're really nice. Um, so much more, so much more crisp. Because, um, like, in restaurants, they're just so salty. I actually don't even put salt on my food. And um, when I want to go to restaurants, I don't like them at all. So I like homemade pizzas, but I like restaurant burgers. Uh, oh, weird. If a tortoise, if a tortoise, oh, sorry, if a tortoise loses its shell, is it naked or homeless? Um, is this a riddle or an actual question? Um, because, well, if a if a tortoise loses its shell. Doesn't it die? Because it's part of its like ske um, skeleton. Yeah, the, the shell's attached to its ribcage. Um, yeah, so if, if that's a riddle, um, I would. If it's a riddle, I would say both, naked and homeless. But if you're asking for real, yeah, the, it, it would die. So, um, I don't know how to answer that. I did answer it, but I don't know if that's the correct answer you wanted. Are you going to be releasing booty building training videos? Yes, I am. Um, I'm going to be doing more videos, more training videos um, on here. Um, I'm also going to be releasing a guide. Um, so I'm going to do intros for you um, on here, and then I'll be releasing a guide for you. So yeah, there'll be a lot more booty building videos and tips and I'm also going to put scientific methods on um, reasons why you change the angle why you hold it why you would do some isolated some compound um, and which ones come after each, each, each other so yeah I will be doing a lot more guides on that for you don't worry so I'm trying to find what what are five things you do every day? Oh, that's a good one. Okay. So five things I do every day. It's quite interesting to think of. So I'll just run you through my day and maybe that'll answer it. Because five things. Um, so I wake up and I will always have lemon water. Um, lemon water is very good for your skin helps to balance your pH levels and is good for your digestion so it's very important um, I do recommend that actually to have lemon water in the morning um, and with warm water because it's much more beneficial actually because um, it activates the lemon a lot more um, five, that's one so two, so lemon water oh so I have a list um, I work through every week um, list of tasks and goals I need to I, I need to do, and I ensure I can't even talk. Sorry, guys. Okay, so I do um, I do have a list of things I need to do throughout the whole week, and every day I need to hit at least three of these items. I need to check them off, or at least make very very good stages to getting one ticked off. So, um, so if I'm not near those three, then I need to be very close. I have a good reason to myself. And why I've not done that. So oh, that's only two. Um, five things. No matter what, um, I will always do a workout. But you know, I do have a rest, okay, but I will have active rest and that will mean I could go for a walk or I'll go do yoga or go swimming. Um, so I'm always active, I'm always doing something. Um, yeah, so that's something I do every day. I will always do some sort of activity, whether it's the gym, um, walking, yoga, etc. So, that's only three. Um, hmm, this is quite a good question. 
you have to, you have to actually have to think about this one. So one, two, three, four. I need another one. Hmm. Five things. What's a girl to do? <sighs> I don't know. Oh, always get twenty a minimum of twenty thousand steps. Um, I think that's that's very important. A lot of people will just go for ten, but I'm a very active person. I walk everywhere. I've got an active role. Um, so yeah, I always get twenty thousand a day minimum. Um, I do set my watch um, to, to beep. Um, like well, you've got thirty, um, but I always hit minimum of twenty. That's four, right? I think it's four. Okay, let's go for five. One more. Hmm. Oh! I will always send a message to somebody every day on why I appreciate them. Or either, if. I, oh, sorry. I will always send a message to somebody on why I appreciate them. Or, I would tell them why they mean so much to me, and um, yeah, that's, that's something I would do. I'm sure I've done four. Shall I throw one in? Another one in? I think I've only done four. I think I've just done... Oh, okay. So it's just in one more. So, um, gotta think even more now. Hmm. It's quite a hard one, you know. Hmm. Try to think. I don't know if this is worth mentioning, um, but I do try to log my sleep a bit more. Um, this is something I've been doing lately because I don't get a lot of sleep. I do struggle to get to sleep. Um, so what I've been doing lately, I've been logging it, and I've actually, um, yeah, I, I do struggle to sleep a lot, because um, I'm quite a light sleeper, like anything anything will wake me up, absolutely anything. Um, like I live in an apartment block, and if I, I can hear people across the hall, just exiting or coming, or coming back in, and yeah, that wakes me up. So I do struggle a lot. So I'm, yeah, I'm managing my sleep a lot more. Um, that's what I'm doing every day now. Um, let's start something new. Um, I'm finding traits in what's causing me to lose sleep. So I'm changing things throughout the day. Um, I'm drinking a lot more water, and that's helped me a lot. I've stopped, stopped having carbs after six o'clock. I know it's a very stereotypical thing to say um, because a lot of people are oh that does nothing for you blah 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 but I found that my stomach it just feels lighter um, I've been having more car I've been replacing my carb macros okay by increasing my vegetables but I've not been having rice or oats or potatoes after six o'clock I've been replacing them with more vegetables and I'm finding that's helping me yeah, just, I don't know, I just feel clearer in my stomach and I'm just able to relax a bit more. I'm not feeling so bloated before I go to bed, so that's helping as well. I don't think you wanted to know that. Yeah, just, I don't want a big belly. So, you know, when you just go to sleep and you're just like, oh, I feel big. You know, that's how I felt. And I've not been feeling like that lately, so that's good. Da -da 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 -da. So, we have... A favourite muscle group to train? Um, I would say, even though, like, I don't think my shoulders are very prominent, but they have become my favourite muscle group to train lately because I can see them changing, um, and I'm doing lots of different angles. Um, I've been changing things a lot uh, with my shoulders, so lately, that is my favourite muscle group to train. It used to be my glutes, because um, I used to experiment a lot with that as well, and um, now it's shoulders now. So, um, we have one more. Um, 
where do you see yourself in five years? That was quite a thoughtful one, that. Okay. Where do I see myself in five years? I see myself being a business owner, um, but I want to be owning a gym that has a spa and a food place. Um, so I want a good, I want a wellness um, centre. Um, and outside there'll be boot camps. And yeah, that's why I see myself in five years. I see myself as a business owner helping people and having well-being, not just on the outside, but inside as well. Um, there'll be several floors um, for these different areas. Um, and yes, that's what I'm, that's what I'm building towards in five years. Um, so, that is my first Q&A. Um, I think I rambled, really. I'm not sure if you got anything out of that, but if you did, um, please let me know in the comments. Um, if you want to, basically, if you want me to do another one, um, yeah, again, hit me up in those comments and um, I'll do another one for you. So, thank you very much for watching and I'll be posting more videos and I'm going to be doing one every week for you. Alright, take care guys. Bye.